silent, silent, please, silent. Hey everybody, we're live. Welcome, welcome, welcome. As always, weekly AMA session on the Develop YouTube channel regarding what's going on in the NFT world and how the Develop team has been working successfully with their roadmap and goals. As always, Alex Shadagubov, the CEO and founder of the Develop Nisa and me, Eugene Creepy MC. Would you just like? Subscribe, share, do not forget to do that because we've been putting a lot of content for you guys on a weekly basis, two twice, twice a week, two podcasts, AMA session. By the way, if you missed a couple of hours ago, AMA with the Bloxport, one of the oldest partner about the Bally's NFT 2.0 launch, about the testimony of RAP and NFT since once before, just rewatch, you may find this on our YouTube channel or in the Telegram. Chat to Alex, my readings. Let's start with the news of the week. Uh, what goals has successfully been accomplished by the team we should be proud of and we need to share with our audience on this week? Um, so th this week uh, we signed agreement with the uh, OK X chain. Uh, so we will uh, be integration with the chain. I should say we also are already integrated with it. So there we will deploy our protocol and execute several solutions for NFT marketplace and launchpad maybe. And uh, afterwards, uh, I think we'll integrate with several projects on OKX chain. Um, and uh, these guys see big potential of wrapped NFTs as a new class of assets, especially a very functional class of assets. So we'll be diving more deeply into this. And uh, uh, maybe as you have seen a few hours ago, we, um, our partners, Bolis, um, finished their launch on crypto.com. Uh, so they sold their NFTs. And then we'll be working on uh, mechanics to implement uh, wrapped NFT technology with uh, different settings to their collection. And so I think this are our two main news uh, during this year uh, week. Yeah. By the way, uh, if you didn't see uh, the AMA with Thomas Thomas uh, Krzystek, the co-founder of Polis, and the, they have been our partner since the day one. Uh, I think since uh, the beginning of the time, one of the first AMA was with the blocks blocks board, and today he said the great phrase we asked him, uh, why did they choose Envelop protocol, growing protocol in general? Why did they pay attention to that? And he said, the like, quotation, this is a great product, Envelop protocol, in my opinion, because it allows for lots of flexibility in building extra layers on top of NFTs, which may come in handy when developing the Bellies game. Sounds fantastic. What do you think, Alex? Uh, why Thomas is super satisfied with having Envelop as the partner? Why he really values us? Because uh, uh, the protocol is real uh, flexible and functional. And in games, uh, this concept haven't been realized yet. Uh, so the guys want to be the first to execute build tokens con concept. And uh, maybe one of the first to use our non-pledge rental mechanics. Uh, which we will be also executing with our partners of digital. Uh, so they are finishing their marketplace for game items where users will be able to rent them without paying pledges. But uh, and thus we think to grow a uh, secondary market for uh, NFTs and also solve for multiple problems of uh, guilds of gamers and scholars. Uh, where we can have real uh, rental, not just now the transferring of ownership of accounts to play uh, for games and then waiting for a long time for their um, price funds. For proceeding, by the way, let's remind how many partners a sort of block sport on Velop team has already acquired and has already implemented. And this means we could also have their testimonials, by the way. <laughs> I think we will have opened the testimonials part of the section of the website with quotations and the photos of our partners. How many of them are a sort of uh, Thomas? He could give us a sort of testimonials. Who are they, our partners? 
Uh, With uh, use cases implemented already. So these partners uh, are mainly from game field also, as I mentioned about okay, exchange um, ecosystem. Uh, so uh, hard to say <laughs> the exact name. There are several dozens of them and mainly- Just name the project, name the projects. Lot trade uh, and so on and so forth. Mm. Uh, lot trade, uh, Bollis, as you said, also you've uh, working with them. Um, Guys from Rap Racing, they are making uh, playing kind of a new game, and uh, with the Animoca family, especially. Um, guys, uh, okay, I forget the name of uh, their platform. Uh, they also use uh, they kind of maintain platform for games, uh, Olympo, Olympo guys. Uh, with them also we execute also or digital uh, it's about uh, rental non-pledge rental uh, nft craft uh, unit box these guys are also about metaverse and games and non-pledge rentals uh, so uh, they are also gate chain then we also implement uh, previously, I mentioned uh, last uh, AMAs, it's uh, Harmony and the ARC system near. Uh, so there are plenty of work for <laughs> our dev team now. Yeah, and now I remember, you know, I remember that recently I did the AMA session with our partner Lot Trade, and he uh, was uh, talking with uh, their partner named CPOT Launchpad. This is an NFL Launchpad, it's not a competitor for Envelop. And I asked them, so I realized that CPAT had chosen lot trade because uh, lot trade had implemented wrapped NFTs. So if uh, lot trade had not implemented wrapped NFTs, he wouldn't wouldn't have had so uh, wouldn't uh, have been so valued for his partner CPAT. And I asked guys from CPAT and from lot trade, how was valued wrapping NFTs for you? And both of them answered me directly. That's because of wrapping this concept is excellent. And we, Lotrade, have used this because we uh, needed, needed so, so well as, and we, CPAT, uh, choose uh, Lotrade because of wrapping the NFT. That, so that means that we've had <laughs> not <laughs> one testimonial from Tomash for now. We had three testimonials from Tomash, Lotrade, and even CPAT, who, who does know a lot of us, who's not our partner, but he, he heard about uh, Envelop. So this how business is growing, uh, and this is this is a good result, I think. So uh, I'll find this AMA on the Lot Trade YouTube channel. By the way, I dropped the link down for this AMA. So our partners, and not even our partners, they value Envelop because Envelop is a part of the world NFT ecosystem, dear community members. And thank you for staying with us, the community member. This is your success too. So Alex, tomorrow stars NFT Bali. Uh, the yeah. Ubud, the first offline event in Asia, and you is going to be the speaker there. Let me prove my statement with your photo on the website here. And look at Alex. He's here, Alex Yadagubov. So are you ready for this event? What do you expect from this event? Whom do you invite there? Uh, so I plan to meet uh, some interesting people, maybe find new collaborations. Uh, there I will speak about uh, financial aspect of NFTs, which we execute, cross-chain uh, utility of them. So one of our advisors uh, offered us this event, then we applied and organizers find out our solution rather interesting to be shared there. Uh, mainly I suppose to see their um, creators or uh, from artistic field of NFT guys. Uh, so we'll offer them new <laughs> facilities from chain royalties, uh, funds collection, side NFT, and uh, kind of insurance things for them. Excellent. Now I'm looking for this AI. This is the AMA. I'm just dropping the link on this AMA with CPAT and Lot Trade. So, how do you think? Should we implement the testimonial section on our website? Uh, where Ooh. to put? Yeah, sure. Because uh, we need to collect uh, uh, these uh, points of view uh, for our community as well and uh, new team members who will join and uh, maybe the members from the partners community 
I think for them it will be useful to hear uh, the feedback uh, from the dev team about our protocol and maybe they can also join our community and find more use cases for us. Okay, okay, okay. So let me, uh, a couple of technical questions to change, change my account. So what else, what other news should we discuss now? Uh, let me, give me, give me, give me a second, please. Okay. Give me a second, I need to technical. It's oh. easy. <laughs> You need to change the password. <laughs> no. Oh, you do see my password. Oh, okay. So our live our live stream is going on. I've lost my account. Oh, okay. I'm I'm inside. I think it's correct. So you have to change the password. <laughs> you ready? <laughs> sorry, sorry. That's the technical technical side of our work. So we are now. So I what I'm trying to do. I'm putting the link of uh, Ama with uh, a lot. Uh, lot and uh, see Pat Pat with the testimonial uh, Bonimal about envelop radical. Okay. So uh, one of the main news for this week is about X-Infinity, which is working on Ronin sidechain. Ronin is, a, as I know, the sidechain for Ethereum. And he had experienced a hack for $600 million recently, and Binance invests $150 million in SkyMaris, that's a startup of staying uh, Infinity Creator, uh, X Infinity Creator. So uh, this is not concerning for about NFT directly, but Alex, do you think we need to exclude or to have some knowledge, extract some knowledge from this news for us? What does it all mean, such hacks and such a news for, for us, for the well community? Any, any ideas? Uh, so during this year, uh, happened plenty of such hacks, especially with uh, bridges. Uh, so and this is also was the way we uh, learned lessons and uh, how the concept was learned about uh, cross-chain mechanic uh, using wrapped NFTs and L3 solutions. Uh, so I think guys from uh, SkyMaris will be more things now and uh, <laughs> i think uh, guys from binance really good is in them uh, to give uh, such an amount of money to um, to go away from such a problem by the way we should notice that the, these money uh won't be uh, uh used for for development, they, as I do understand, they will simply be used for compensation, the funds to reimburse users affected by the recent hack. So this is going to be the compensation, the shame compensation for this life, for, for this hack. Okay, we'll see. The security questions have uh, always been with us and will always be with us because we're in crypto space where security matters a lot. So, ladies and gentlemen, let me remind you about our DAO Ambassadors program. You may see the Medium post on your web or on your screens and um, they found in a link below. So, who are Ambassadors? Please join our Ambassadors program. Ambassadors are sort of top evangelists of the protocol who help, in fact, help to leave and do a lot of job uh, required uh, human resources. Uh, for example, write articles, make, make videos, translate articles and so on, so forth. a lot of marketing work. So this is a part, partly involvement, in fact, the fact involvement in the Envelop team. If you love what Envelop has been doing, if you do understand the potential of rapid entity concept, if you do understand that Envelop is the part of the world crypto, crypto infrastructure, I would say, that envelop is backed by 
The brilliant minds and brilliant venture companies such as Animoca Brands, for example, envelop as the part of Animoca Brands family, guys. Do not forget it. And by the way, uh, so be subscribed to our YouTube channel because a lot of guests from uh, backed by Animoca 2, so our close, I would say, relatives or close friends backed by Animoca 2 will be appearing in our podcast and we'll be talking about their project, <coughs> Web Free NFTs, the concept of wrapping. So uh, being a, an ambassador is a great honor. And if you decide to do that, it's quite easy to join. Read this Medium post, then find the link on the Google form in the description and apply for ambassadors program. Be our ambassadors, be the part of an developed team, not less, I would say. So, Alex, uh, what should we say more? Perhaps we've said, uh, what do you expect in April? Let's remind what are the plans of Envelope for April. So in April, uh, already is launched uh, Scotch NFT marketplace uh, with our partners, uh, especially made for wrapped NFTs and liquidity uh, NFTs, we can name them. Um, we plan to execute the case uh, with our OK Exchange, uh, the first project of them. Uh, we plan to integrate. It's about wrapped NFT launchpad, also. Uh, and uh, as for others, um, the, uh, or digital, it's about rentals. Uh, we get good chances to uh, launch the first um, version also in April, and. Um, there are, will be implementations on chain. Uh, maybe we'll, I think for testnet of near will be uh, in April. Uh, and um, so I think it's the main. Uh, if I'm and not mistaken, uh, as I currently read uh, the last uh, messages, well, I could, do we plan to join uh, with a partnership with Velas blockchain? Is that correct? Uh, the the guys got interest. We will start to communicate. Uh, so, uh, our market Jonathan connected with them, uh, so we just uh, starting and this way. Uh, so we are open to any change. Um, it's uh, the case of about synergy how we can benefit from it and their chain as well. Uh, so because our dev team is already hard working, uh, so we need now. Um, make a focus efforts to gain the more result. Okay, so one more question I would love to show uh, you about uh, uh, wrapped NFT store or marketplace uh, wrap and go. Yes? Yeah. Uh, it is on our screens now and we plan to launch this. Uh, tell us, please briefly, what is it, how it works and what should any digital art uh, artist do on our rep how may he create his nft and sell is that a sort of personal uh, marketplace for nft without uh, needless, needless to not to go for open sea to open there uh, the marketplace so digital yeah. artists, how it works so here we collected so all our uh, kind of uh, rep NFTs as festive ones, all um, cases and useful links, not to jump uh, around different uh, links by not to remember them. I hear it's more convenient to use. Uh, so you see as um, a seasonal, the first ones were for Chinese New Year, also new projects. So you see a uh, rep NFT marketplace will be yeah, and also about the news for April, I forgot to name the main. We are launching DAO page in April, and first micro DAO cases also will be there, especially the Rept NFT Launchpad uh, and the Rept NFT Marketplace Scotch. Okay, okay. A lot of services. So I do see that develop is multifunctional, uh, versatile tool for doing a lot of cases. Tens, tens of uh, dozens of different use cases may uh, uh, have been implemented with using OpenML. That all means, guys, that Envelope has a very brilliant future. So stay with Envelope, subscribe on our YouTube channel. I remind you that we have been putting the podcast about Web3 twice a week. We've been putting AMA sessions 
on a weekly basis, on every Friday, weekly AMA with Alex. Uh, additionally, AMA with our partners, like Billy's, uh, for example, uh, on a couple, couple hours ago. Then we put Twitter spaces. Uh, then we answer any questions in the Telegram chat. Uh, join our social media, stay with us, ask your questions in the comments below of the AMA. Ask your questions on there. By the way, let's check our web, our chat. Don't we have questions? Yeah, we don't have questions from our viewers. Okay, no problem. So that's all for today. This has been the first week of April. Stay tuned for further good weeks with Envelope. Thank you very much. And bye-bye, guys. See you Bye. later. Okay.